What's up, y'all? This is Mel and Keisha back with another eating chat. I'm Mel. I'm Keisha. And this is a walk in a fat woman's shoes. How y'all doing, MK Saints? Visitors, passing through. Uh, tonight, eating chat. I have stuffed bell pepper and tomatoes with some zucchini on the side. Keisha got some little pork slide. Wait. Mm, smashed some meatballs. Some smashed meatballs. And Alfredo sauce. We drinking on that good old age too old. Big girl ain't here, but big girl will do what? Nothing. Girl, please. Save you in a crisis. Yes, it's she will. Yes, yeah, she will. Shit for you not. What? It's winter. She ain't doing shit for you not. Oh, yeah. She's still going to do shit for me, baby, because I drink water all year round. How to get yeah, a big girl. Yeah, but you need no cold water in winter like that. I do. No, you don't. I do. Moving right along. Anyway, I had to get a big girl, a big swole, a big baby, or even a male baby. Will be in the description box below. See, go on, click that link. You go on, get yourself when you order to yourself. Go on, do it. Go on, do it. You ready? Mm. God is good. God is great. Thank you for being about your shoes. I show you never spare for the month. Amen. 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 So what's going on with you guys tonight? Let us know what y'all eating and if y'all eating with us. Also let us know what's going on in y'all nigga the woods, how you weather trinket and what y'all did today. Y'all know I'm nosy. I'm nosy. Y'all know I'm nosy. Mm-hmm. Our weather was fine today. Yeah, it was pretty good. Mm-hmm. 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 And it's part rain. They just they decided to do it a different way. They stuffed them. They stuffed them with uh. Hmm, it's on the tip of my tongue and I can't get it up. They stuffed them with kisses. And they was eating that. I don't do cookies, so I definitely wasn't doing that. It's good. I think my um Alfredo sauce is a little bit too thick. Mm. Oh, that's what I got in the bowl. Here, yeah, my knees in the bowl. Cause they were meatballs, right? And so I made mixed meatballs, and so I made my baby doing. I started to just make me, you know, a little dressing, you know, a little carnival dressing, but I was like, nah, I ain't gonna do it. I'll probably do it tomorrow. But even so, I already had these, you know, had my meatballs ready to go. So, I put them in some butter, put them in that skillet, and just smash them down just a little bit. I ain't smashed them down too far. So, I smashed them down just enough. What is it stuffed with? Ground beef, rice, zucchini, some other, some other vegetables and stuff. Wow. Top with a raised salt. So excuse me. Mm, that's nice. These are better than the last ones I made. Because the last one I didn't season them. My son was like, it's still good. All right, you know. I have to do better than that. I ain't even put salt in it. In your bell peppers? Yeah. Mm. They messed up for that. I had never really saw that Frank's Red Hot uh, commercial and everything, but 
Man, one the first the first part of the commercial, the dog back the wing out the guy hand while the chick you know sprinkling the hot sauce on the wings. Then the next thing this man put his finger in the hot dog bun and slide out the hot dog because he was about to put what was that ketchup or something on on all right. People lift him up. I have a crazy commercial. So what's going on with y'all? What's what's happening with y'all weather? Y'all world? I the tomato oh, the same thing. That Betty White print too. Oh, it's on now? No, that's pump. Oh. I know what that is. I'm saying on that channel. No, but I think it's on Tubi. Oh. oh, them old people used to do their thing. Now I know why. My son was willing to pay me for my other tomato. Oh my God. Football and the Eagles did a beautiful job, especially towards the end. I was like, Don't give up. And y'all, I ain't no Eagles fan. But, they played them girls to me. They did, because they was coming back. They were trying to come back. But them Eagles were hey, right now. Nah, I don't think so. Y'all ain't about to do that. For real. All right. He probably got headphones on there. Oh, you don't. Mm. Well, I'm getting full. And I ended I have four of them on here for these, for my meatballs. They're about, they're about that big, right? That big. I'm gonna finish three. And I'm getting full. When I drink that water, it's over. Cause I know if I if I eat this, if I keep going and just eat this, I'm just eating it to be eating it. I don't need to be doing that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That's a shame. Good. 
this girl got me watching some. Is it It Factor? Fear Factor. Fear Factor. I haven't watched Fear Factor in umpteen years. Umpteen years, yo. Me neither. Because my thing is this I cannot. I, I, me, this guy right here. I cannot go on nobody's camera, even off camera. I can't do that. I cannot lay up the and be putting no damn worms in my mouth. Uh, uh, what up? The worms in my mouth. Uh, the getting bit by snakes. Uh, uh, getting in water with sharks. I can't be doing. Mm, I ain't doing stuff like that. Mm, mm. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. And then not only that. Riding cars and almost uh, collide with another car or running or go into something, you know what I mean? I don't know. To me, Fear Factor is like uh, they teach you how to be a stunt double or something because you are doing some of the worst shit ever. Ever. Mm -mm -mm. And me, I don't have time for it. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. I don't have time for it. Mm mm. Mm -hmm. what happened. I ain't got time for that shit. Yo, one day, I'm going to tell y'all about these lashes, right? I put these lashes on because I bought this little, these little things, right? Because I ain't going to lie, whenever I be putting them on with the glue, sometimes, you know, you know, once you finally, once I finally get it on the eyelash, sometimes the glue is still stuck up. Stuck up here and now and I gotta do all this here to get the glue off and stuff, right? But I bought these little things. They're like little lash strips that I got from Timu, right? And they lash strips. They they cute. And you put it on there. One day, I uh I caught myself going to sleep in the lashes because you know as they were showing you with the lashes, you could just pull the lash and it don't come off. It be on for. Uh, you know, a day or two, right? I call myself going to sleep with the lashes. When I woke up, you know how you wake up, you go to the bathroom or whatever, however, when you go to look in the mirror, I, this lash was up here. You know, it was like, you know, it was like that, right? And this one was on my jaw. I'm like, I said, you know what? Never again. I ain't listening to nobody with that bullshit. My cousin go get her lashes, um, <coughs> what is it, song? What is it? Thready. Thready? Thready? I don't know, but she go get her lashes done. I think it's Thready? I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but I told her I want to get that, you know, I want to get that for my graduation. I'm going to go get my lashes done like that. You know, um, I want to get my lashes done like that because, you know, I'm sick of, you know, going to sleep or whatever. I must have had a hard night. I'm telling you. For one lash to, liter to literally come off and be <coughs> on my jaw. And the other one just be. <coughs> it be still like on the lash. But like the other one is just up on the. Uh, <coughs> up here I'm like. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I told uh, I told Rika I wanted her to make my face up. But I, I could do my own. You know, I can make my own face up or whatever. However, I'm trying to. Find a venue because I want to I want to have a little party. I want to have a small party or whatever. And I just want to find a small venue or a hotel. You good, baby? Yeah, I'm good. Or a hotel that they let me use their conference room. You know what I'm saying? So that I can have the party, you know? And, um, I'm, I am stuck like Chuck because, like, if I was home, I wouldn't know where to go because they got clubs. They got businesses that you could, you know, all that, but I ain't home. And so, you know, I would chill, you know. I don't know nothing. I don't know people like that, and I don't know no places I can go to do that. So now it's November. I need to get on the ball because my graduation is December 16th. So I need to be getting on the ball and finding out where I can go because my cousin, he asked me when he came today, he was like, he was like, you getting the food catered? Yeah, I'm catering my own shit. The fuck? No. I, I, no, 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 no. I'm doing my own stuff. And I don't know how I want, I don't know the theme of the foods that I want to do. I don't know if I want to do it like 
brunch style or dinner style or even just like lunch buffet. You know, if y'all have some suggestions in the comment, y'all let me know. Because, I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm catering this event, but I want to be able to eat myself. You know what I'm saying? I want to be able to eat without being, you know, without, uh, what's the word? Deprived because, not deprived, I'm not going to say deprived. I, I want to be able to eat, but I don't want to endure all the, all the carbs. Because, like, you know, I was I was thinking about sliders, you know, different sliders and, you know, cupcakes and uh, pies. I don't know. You know, now, don't get me wrong. I don't know if I'm going to, I'll probably eat a cupcake, you know, get a little, you know, a little, uh, what they call it? A little candle in it. Put it in there. I probably eat that cupcake, but other than that, I ain't going to be eating sweets like that, but I am going to make a few sweets because, you know, you can't, you can't just put no table out there, no graduation table, and don't have no kind of sweets out there. Come on now. No, you can You can, but who does that? Not me. I, a baker. I will not do that. Mm-hmm. 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 No, no ma'am. No ma'am. Mm-hmm. I'm going to bake. I'm a bake, you know, but uh, Curtis is like, when I told him I'm doing my own thing and I'm baking, he went, like, oh, Lord, because they know whenever I bake, it has to be on point. If there is any, if it tastes any kind of way I don't like, I don't know, I think it, I have a nervous tick. I was making a cake one day and the cake didn't come out. It, it it didn't rise the way I wanted it to. And when I took it out the pan, it just didn't look the way I wanted it. And all of a sudden, I know I shouldn't have did that because it's food. You know, you don't do that. You know, I just started hitting it. I just started beating it because I couldn't, I couldn't deal with the fact that it didn't come out the way I wanted it. You know, it, it's like when I cook and I'm, I, I'm doing... And I cook for people and I bake for people. It got to come out 100. You know what I mean? It got to because if it don't, I have a fit. I have a fit. You know, so I do. I will literally have a fit. No, no joke. Look at that. And then they got to drive off that man. Ain't no way. Man, ain't no way. But yeah, I would literally have a fit, and um, you wreck the car. I can't, I can't do that. So I, I am going to, I am going to do my baking, but I'm going to do them the night before. Well, the day, be, yeah, the night before, because I'm not making a whole lot. Is I mean, I, it, this is just going to be an intimate party, you know, just an intimate party for like. Maybe 20, 30 people, 30 at the most. I ain't trying to, you know, go crazy or nothing like that. 20, 30 people at the most, you know. How do we get from 12 to 20 to 30? I don't know because, uh, cuz say he's inviting his girl, you know, and, uh, my cousin, oh, uh, I'm about to say she's gonna invite her, her man, but, you know, I just don't know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? No, no, yeah, you know, I'm talking about, you know, what I'm talking about, but anyway, anyway, you know, you know, okay, anyway, you know, I mean, I have a cuz that you know want to, that's probably gonna want to bring me, you know, significance, and that's all I'm gonna say, significance, you know, and uh, I know, I know our daughter's on come, she's gonna want to bring them out to tea. She gonna want to bring the multitude, which I mean, I don't, I don't have no problem with it, but you gotta tell me how many people coming. You know that that's my thing. I need to know how many people coming so I know how much food to put out. You know, cause I'm, I don't know. I mean, I'm to the point. You know, just get go to uh, Sam's, get them two big bags of chicken wingettes, make some deviled eggs, some caprese's, which you know. You know, it's the mozzarella, the tomato, and the um, olive. That's a good say to me. Even though I know you put basil, you know, but I'll put the olive instead of the basil because, you know, there's people that probably wouldn't want the 
basil that's never had the basil <laughs> tomato mozzarella experience so you know um some chicken wings some meatballs some uh uh assorted kind of cupcakes because i don't want to just do one flavor cupcake i want to do maybe two to four different uh flavors of cupcakes then um sweet potato pies the little mini sweet potato pies um maybe do that like little quiches or whatever something like that um sliders or just You're doing do... too much yeah but i'm saying i want to be able to feed people i don't want you to just <coughs> just a little graze no that's not me when i do a party i want to feed you i want to feed you i want you to at least leave like you ain't gotta go eat right then and then. you ain't gotta go eat right after you and left i want to feed you you know what i'm saying i want you to eat and be comfortable you hear me I don't want you to, oh, oh, this all you got, this, this, you know, this little shit, these little, mm, 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 that's all y'all got. I'm going to have to take a whole thing of that just to get full. No, no. Mm -mm. Make pinwheels and out of mean cheese. Yes. Uh, what about a uh, crab salad? You going to make it? Yeah. Girl, you tripping? You don't, you act like I can't make it, uh, crab salad. What kind of crab you gonna use? Imitation crab. Imitation crab because for well, one, I don't know how many people come. You know, I only want to get the venue for up to thirty people. That is covering, you know, everybody that come. You know, cause I don't want them to say, oh, well, we can't get the venue because you went over. Two people, you know, you went 22 <coughs> people, or, you know. No, so I want to be able to get that, but I also want to. <sighs> and see, that's, that's another thing. I need to be able to pull this off. The graduation is for 11, and I want to be able to pull this off for at least by at least seven by at least seven and i know i can i mean it ain't hard i know i can if i have to hope but if i'm doing it by myself i'm going to have to probably do it the next day but i know if i have help i'll be able to pull it all by seven so i don't know i don't know what yeah. i want to do 7 p.m yeah pull it all by seven making all the stuff Making all the stuff, well, transforming it, you. all that, you know, all that, all that. More power to you. And if I don't go, if I don't do a party, then guess they're going to take me to Pizza Hut. We're going to take you, <laughs> you know how to we, Pizza Hut. You know how they used to do us when we graduated from school and stuff, when we was little and stuff? You graduate, after your graduation, get take you to Pizza Hut. Go ahead, baby, you can get what you want, that Pizza Hut. Like, Hell no. I can't get everything I want here. Fuck. <laughs> Stop. No. We're going to take you to the pizza buffet. Five no. ninety nine a person. Girl. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. What's wrong with that? What's wrong with CC's pizza? Nah, we could probably go. I mean, if if I if I don't do a party, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be sad. I'm gonna be upset. I've been telling you for months. We go to Chili's or something. Save up your money and every, we could just go to a restaurant, get that part of the restaurant, and we could celebrate your graduation. You fucking what restaurant? Well, it depends on how much you want to pay. Are you paying for everybody? Yeah. Well, that depends on what you want to pay. I mean, yeah, I will pay for everybody. shit. I mean, don't get me wrong, even though they should be paying for me because it's my graduation, but, you know, I digress, you know. Because, you know, you get those people, I shouldn't have to pay for you. And then if, then when you paying for them, they want the highest shit on the damn, on the thing. They don't want, they don't just want this, this. You don't uh, have that problem. They don't want the Chinese buffet. 
They don't want this. Why are you looking at me like that in horror? They don't want the 1999 or the 2499 steak. They want the market price steak. Or the market price, this or the market price. They want everything that's on market price. The shit that they don't show you the prices for, that's the ones they want. When you pay for other people, but when they have to pay for you or paying for themselves, you won't look, look. Cut this menu, cut this. Look, see this part of the menu? Don't look at that. Act like that part of the menu. That's blank. not how you do that. No, it's not, but you know. No, I'm talking to you. You you go there, you look at the menu. You pick two, three plates. This is what we offering our guests. This is all. Like a win? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, I mean, I like that. I like that. But I just don't see doing seafood for people and they don't know how to eat seafood. They don't know how to crack the crack. Come on now. Haven't you ever had... People eat seafood. They don't know what they doing. People told me I was petty because I was saying don't waste my money. So I I can't speak on that. Yeah. Talking about we know you paid for a drink. Got to do that, bitch. Do you know how much I paid for a right. drink? Fuck you. You you fucking cash that nigga uh, money again. Yeah, I mean. Y'all got if y'all we, If, we willing, to, if we willing to pay this kind of money for y'all, don't mess over it. Don't do that. Don't do that because there's people that could be that could take your place. Huh? That could take your place and do a better job eating this food and not mess it over. Or bring it home with them. Even if you bring it home and throw the fish out afterwards. You know what I'm saying? You know, but... Man, I don't really know how to eat no crab. Just show me how to do this and I got it. And they know the place I'd want to go is Red Lobster. If it's I have funny. to go there, I want to go to Red Lobster. Or I want to go to a burger place where I can get burgers. You know, I ain't got to, you know, I don't have to get no buns. You know, and I can get seafood. I don't have to get all that, you know, all that craziness, you know. But I don't know. I have... I have a little, I have a little time, just a little time to figure it out. Cause I ain't gonna lie, I've been, I've been kind of, you know, I've been thinking about it ever since last month and stuff. But it's like November is here, you know. You need to get on your shit. You need to do what you're gonna do. It either you gonna have a party or either you gonna go out to dinner, or uh, out to lunch with your people, do something, you know. Cause I mean, shit, I don't, I wouldn't mind going to Papa do. You know, I wouldn't mind going there, but I can't do that. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't got no pop those money like that. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do no pop those like that. Only people who be going to pop those is me and her. If they, me and her, that be it. We see y'all at McDonald's. <laughs> no, nah, nah, but uh, Curtis is like, you could come over here and celebrate. I don't want no damn Whataburger. I didn't have Whataburger so damn much. I am sick of them patty melts, Jesus. Of the patty melts, I ain't gonna lie. I still eat the patty melts with no bun and stuff, you know, because when I don't feel like cooking or whatever, you know, him up to well, or even though I ain't never bring me a patty melt or whatever and stuff. And I, I just... I don't want that for my graduation. Me personally, I want a good sit-down seafood meal. <clears throat> I want a seafood lunch or seafood dinner. That's what I basically want. That's what I want. You know, that's what I want. You know, that's what I want, you know. And you know what I mean? I'm not able to go nowhere. Some, somebody can make it for me, you know what I'm saying? You know. And they make seafood real, real good, you know. They really do. They really do, you know. I would really enjoy that. I would too. <laughs> <laughs> if somebody would just make me, you know, a nice little seafood dinner. 
Did that person get electrocuted? No. What? Uh-uh, uh uh, uh, -uh Nosy. Uh-uh. And then that's a white. And I have white sauce on it. That just look bad. That looks bad. That looks bad, y'all. That... I'm not watching this with you. Uh uh. After this, I, I'm. After this, I want to do some no, stuff and then look, I'm going in the room. What they do is they put you in a car on mm. side of the building and they just drop the car. <gasps> and these people, man, look, people do anything for money these days. That's crazy. That is crazy. Man, ain't no way. I'd be scared to death. I think if I fell out, a, you know, if a car dropped with me in it, I'm already feel like it's my fault because I'm a big bitch. One. And two, I'm just going to die before I hit the ground. Before I hit the ground, just because I'm scared like that, you know? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. That's why I don't like when I'm riding on a bus, you know, on dark or whatever, even in a car, and they get to, and people be on the edge like that or whatever, and sometimes the bus, like, tip over and stuff, I, you know, I be feeling it's like, you know, it's you mine, you, you know, know it's your my seat fault. Belt. I do wear my seatbelt. I do. I wear it. I ain't gonna say I wear it all the time, but I do wear my seatbelt. But I ain't gonna lie, ever since that day, I put on my seatbelt. I said I put on my seatbelt. It was all rusty. You know, I didn't realize the seatbelt, you know, the, the belt was rusty or whatever. Because when I, you know, got out and I took it, took it all, that shit all on my clothes. I'm not saying I don't, I always wear my seatbelt because I'm not, I'm not going to, I don't always wear it. But I do wear it. But ever since that day, I was like, man, fuck that. Fuck y'all in these. Look, I got brakes. <laughs> well, what about the day that we almost got T-boned on the bus? Now, I had a seatbelt on then. No, we both put them on then. Uh-uh, I had my seatbelt on. I had mine on. I was trying to double up with the other seatbelt. Oh, wow. Hmm, yeah. Now, that day, that day, I ain't gonna lie. I did have my seatbelt on, bitch. I was trying to double up, bitch, because I had to put the other seatbelt on. I was like, crap, <laughs> Doing that, sure did. Sure did. Yep. Because it, it, cause it scared me. You know what I'm saying? I already had an experience with curves. Huh? With curves. I already had the experience. And he then gave me multiple personalities. You know. I already have two personalities. He then gave me a third one. He gave me a third one. So. You yeah. sure it's only two? Mm -hmm. well, three. well, I have three now. You know, I have three now because... I think you Honestly, have a little more than three. No, I only have three. I only have three. Forgive me. I'm glad my baby gone. I could go in there and sleep in peace. I can be comfortable. I don't have to worry about a knee or a foot in my back or my <laughs> ass. So, I'm, 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 I'm. Uh. He asked me before he left, will I miss him? And I was like, you don't never be gone long enough for me to miss you. He said it in stone. I'll be here next week, next weekend. I'm like, all right, baby. From your lips to God's ears, baby. Right, he walked out the door. I'll see y'all Friday. Yep. I was like, didn't I just tell you, you asked me my opinion. I gave it to you. Because he asked me that, and I was like, won't you stay home this weekend? And that'll give us time to miss you, you know. You know, just take an extra weekend at home with your people and shit. And he was like, nope, I'll see you Friday. Uh, like, nope, I ain't gonna be able to do it. I ain't gonna be able to do it. <laughs> they cut his little hair off. Yeah. I wanted to do a review with him, but I didn't really have nothing to do a review with him. Because, oh, no, I can't drink that. You know I don't drink milk and... Oh, that looks too weird. He working on my nerves. Yeah, he's, he's so cute. He looks older. He looks older now. He also looks like that. I don't know if y'all ever seen The Temptations. What, what his name is? Otis. 
oldest son, he look like oldest son. You know, why he always in the red? Why, I'm just asking, why he always in the red? You know, you know, that's what he look like. That's how his hair look like. They always say he look like that, but I'm saying that's the first thing popped in my mind. Why he always in the red? Why he always in the red? Yesterday, <laughs> I had him and Keisha uh, watching Rocky. Yes, that was and, my first time uh, ever seeing it. I'm surprised he, he didn't try to change the channel. Nah, he actually was into it. Because he be quick to want to change the channel. Can, okay, Pauline is going out the room. Can we watch something else? And he kicked that shit. Oh, well, we watched all three of them movies. I was like, shut the fuck up. He was like, well, I guess we're going to watch real one and two now. I was and like, it is. Yeah, I went to sleep it on is. one and woke up two was on. I tried to take a nap and somebody would they go be woke me up. You did like Ted Club Lane though, so Yeah I did. I did. And uh I told you what I thought of Rocky. What you thought? Oh, oh people oh, don't yeah. like you. you I, I can't they say. Just it. keep it to yourself. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that to myself. But yeah. Rocky was good though. It was good. It was really good. But I know if I say what I think of Rocky, it is not gonna be misinterpreted. It's just gonna, you know, take you to like, oh, well, you know what? When you think about it, yeah, yeah, it is like that. You know what I'm saying? Uh-uh. You want to know no, some messed no, up no. shit, though? But Rocky was good. I enjoyed I enjoyed the Rockies. I'm trying to watch the other two Rockies, four and five. I as watch much two. as I am a Rocky fan, I have not seen five. What is five about? Is when him and his son moved back to Philly. What happened to Adrian? Adrian died. What? <gasps> oh, you ain't know that? No! Oh. I'm sorry. What she died from? I don't Somebody know. killed her? I don't know. Wow. Oh, ain't that the... And you... So you don't know if nobody killed her? No, I don't think so. I think she just got sick. Damn. What about her brother? Was it... Did he die... No, I probably there. He still there. Ain't that a bitch? Boy, I, I'm sorry. I wanted you to know, fight Paulie. I wanted when, to fight Paulie. I'm so serious. When you watch you owe these me. movies from oh, back in the you day, nuts? again now, they don't really hit the same. Because, right. like, they portray Paulie, like, if you watch any Rocky other than one, they really portray Paulie. He kind of asshole but he's a good guy. But when you watch one, you'll be like, man, if that's my brother, I'd have fucked him up. Look how he fucking talking to her and shit. Come on, you owe me. I put y'all together. You owe me. Bitch, I don't owe you nothing. What the fuck? What I owe you? You want some cigarettes? You want to go night? Because, bitch, that's all you going to get out. That's all you going to get out. Because, bitch, I don't owe you shit. I don't owe you nothing. Oh, I know I saw that, and I'm not looking at that shit again. I, I don't owe you nothing. Not nothing. And then not only that, on three, Rocky three, he worked he, he worked the fucking nerve, because, you know, when uh Creed brought, brought Rocky, him, him, Rocky, and uh, old girl to his place where he used to, where he used to box when he first got his start, he was like, we got to get out of here, Rocky. We got to get out of here. He was like, why? He said, you know how I feel about these people. I don't like these people. He was like, and Rocky was like, they might not like you. He was like, what I did to them. Boy, bitch, what they did to you. Same thing. Same thing. And, I, you know, I already didn't like him from one. Didn't care about, didn't care for him in two. Hated him in three. Hated him in three. You did? Yep. How you gonna come? How you gonna go into business talking about you don't like the people? You don't know them. They ain't did you nothing. How you don't like them? Fuck out of here, man. That boy, you don't do those stupid looking ass now. It's old stupid face. Being a racist. 
Yeah, but the way he tried to play, portray that, he tried to make it look like Rocky would have been racist. Come on, let's, really? If Rocky was racist, Rocky wouldn't even win enough. He wouldn't have went no way enough. Did he even really have the sense to be racist? <laughs> you know what? <laughs> He was just you know trying what? to make it on his own. Yeah, he was. he was. That's all he was doing. I ain't gonna lie. Clever Lane, and that was you fucked over. He fucked over him. He did. Head. You ain't got time he for He fucked the over Rocky. He really did. He really, really. He basically, after he fought Clever Lane, he destroyed Rocky. He destroyed him, man. He made him scared to fucking someone do this shit again. Man, fuck that, man. Old boy was like, man, fuck that. You ain't going out like this, Rocky. I ain't about to let you, motherfucker. I ain't letting you. <laughs> and he told him what he fucking knew. And once he got it, and he fought that fucking, <laughs> fought Mr. Tiaz again, he pitied the fool. Yes, he did. He, boy, he, he kicked his ass. He kicked his ass. He did. He did. That shit was good. Was good. But that, because that bitch clever, he, was, he wanted to fuck with everybody. He was fucking with everybody. You saw how he was fucking with Adrian? Bring your pretty little self over there to my fault, man. <laughs> man, Rocky was like, you want it, you got it. You want it, you got it. <laughs> man, that was some of the funniest shit ever, man. It was, it was so funny. Lord Jesus, that was funny. But anyway, y'all, we gonna go ahead and get up out here. We hope y'all enjoyed this video. We love y'all, y'all. Take care, be blessed. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank you for coming and watching and rocking with us. And until next time, we're going to plant you down and dig you later. Because I know y'all can pick up what we all put now. You hear me? Peace, y'all. What? Oh, yeah, I have your bracelet on, too. Hmm. Huh. Yes. Yeah, it's under my uh things. No, that yeah. one is mine. Yeah, I know. It's under my things. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Well, good night, y'all. Y'all be blessed. Y'all have a good, good night, y'all. Till next time, y'all. Peace, love, and happiness.